this is Cannibal. Today for World Kong 4, I'm, I'll be reviewing the mod called Great Patriotic War. Before I do the review, I would like to thank the modders for helping me out with my mod, Glory of Communism. Both authors helped me out, gave me ideas, and fixed some bugs that I wasn't able to fix. So big shout out to them. As I thank them, they did a big changes, and I'm happy. So today we're reviewing the mod. So first thing you'll notice, there's a fifth conquest. When able to play as them. I did make a tutorial how to make a fifth conquest, and I told them use a new APK, and it worked out nice. So we're so we'll be reviewing each each conquest. The first one look doesn't look any changes to be sure of, but you did notice the speed is faster in the game. So let's go here. I'm gonna go auto. It's very fast. Now let's, re let's take a look at the second conquest. They are they are campaign changes. I'll go over that. So we have a, a nineteen, I think I'm not sure fifty conquest. But I don't know what timer is that. I think alternative history. Looks like the United States took over most of the Soviet Union. Let's. I didn't notice it is they have the hearts of iron colors for most of the countries. Pretty nice. Let's just go into here. Pretty interesting. Some new generals. And even the Americans have tough generals right here. Hmm. PRC is losing territory. That's nice. Let's see anything changes here. Nope. Next conquest. So and this is the same as last time. So any changes? But, but I didn't know the game is a little faster. He did change the files to the game speed, so it's a little more faster when skipping turns. <clears throat> Looks pretty strong, pretty nice. Soviets control. Starting control Japan. And their invasion of Europe. And America. So far, not Canada. We're safe for now. Oh my holy god, the UK has been invaded. So now let's exit this out. Fourth one is alien, <clears throat> it's the aliens, you can play as them. So let's just go like this. So one thing I noticed, the aliens, they can produce regular units. Since he changed the country ID, so you can build, you, you can only build the neutral countries, the the default logo. But if you want to make them have Soviet, you have to change, you have to change it to, to the number. I like change it to 5 for the armor, but it will repl replace the super tank. It will, but no, it won't replace the super tank since there's an ID for the new super tank model. It's hard to explain. You wouldn't understand what I mean, but it's it's complicated. What's his damage? Fourteen hundred versus seven hundred. You know what? Might as well fight this guy. Oh, I need level eight. Great. Yes, to make sure. I can't even build a Titan unit. Berlin, uh, great. You know what? I'll take a look. It's a very fast to turn, which is good. But careful not to put it too high or the game will crash. You know what? I'm gonna get destroyed next turn anyway. No, no point. Alright, now let's go to our fifth conquest, which he added. 
So it looks like I think after the World War II is finished, 1945 Europe, were the four zones of occupation the Americans, Britain, France, and the Soviet Union. He did pretty good with Asia, so it looks like the Chinese Civil War is, starting to, is on a lineup. And it's a pretty good map he did. Let's take a look at the fifth conquest. Looks pretty strong. Let's attack the Americans. And they added the Republic of Germany here, but I would have put Austri Austria here or the uh, divide the country up between American and Soviet and the Allies. But 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 it's pretty good mod. I like it. I might play it when I have some time. So now on to campaign. You can't unlock all the general stars in the after completing the first exercise. Let me find it. So let's see the first exercise. Where is that one? All right, not bad. All right, instead, we're just gonna auto this. It's actually pretty quick when you auto something. Bam. So now let's see. As you lock all the medals now. Iron Cross, Golden Star. So we'll just unlock them quickly. I want to put them on a general and see. All right. All right, that's good. Let's just pick one good general. And we'll grab E Manstein. Gorain. And no picture. Let's see. Accuracy, yes. Armored assault. And he'll be OP general. <clears throat> Another thing, if you complete all the three stage missions, tutorials, you will unlock all the missions. You see here, the Allies, Axis, Cold War, NATO, Warsaw, and the Modern War. So let's go to, let's see, first mission. And we'll be just be putting Manstein. On a general, on a unit. See his damage. Pretty strong and nice. There are some campaign changes, some hard battles that have been replaced, which I don't know. I know I checked last time. There's been a lot of mission changes. But I'm pretty sure they just occupy the hard missions. Oh, good, the hard missions are unlocked. So let's see, maybe we'll take a look at NATO Mission 2. Let's see. I haven't played the Cold War yet, so I don't know all the campaigns. Exit. I think in Cold War, maybe NATO. I know there's a final mission, Red Shadow where you have to capture Moscow, like this mission here. <clears throat> I think this is the custom mission he added, whereas I think this is where you have to lead your forces to capture Moscow, and it'll be a ton of Soviet divisions. 
It's a tough challenge, but it's poss It's very. It, it's kind of easy to win it. When I tried it earlier, I managed to move my forces. Kind of, I did send Macy Tatton to wipe out the Finnish forces. I put a basically put a, get a couple of tank generals artillery, send two up here to take Finland, send the rest into Romania, and then divide your forces to take Kiev, Somalia, and Leningrad. After that's done, you should push to Moscow at least with the rest of the forces. Then after, then your forces in Kiev should push over to Ukraine. Then push all the Tomato units. It's a very hard mission, but it's fun. And it's a pretty easy when you have a good strategy. And that's all for today's mining review. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Have a great day.